Hey everyone, my name is Melissa Jarama and I'm a Drives and Motion Control Product Specialist at ENM. And I'd like to share with you the G120 Smart Access Module, which allows you to configure and diagnose your G120 drive wire free. This wireless solution means no more passing your flash arc barriers, no more climbing ladders to get to inconveniently located control panels, and no more suiting up to get to a control panel that's located in a clean room. This module fits in place of your standard operator panel on any of your G120, G120C, or G120X drives, and it's used with any Wi-Fi compatible device, whether it be your tablet, cell phone, or computer. Let me quickly show you how this works on my computer. To connect to the module, go to your Wi-Fi settings and find the correct network. Then, go to your browser of choice and enter in the module's IP address. Once connected, you'll see your available options here. If you are wondering what you're connected to with the module, you can go to the info button in the right hand corner and see all the information you'd be interested in, such as the firmware version or your power modules part number. If you would like to commission your drive, select the quick setup. The first option to select is your application class. If you have any questions on which one to pick, the arrow in the right hand corner can help you. Next, enter the motor data. What type of motor do you have and what is its nominal information? For your macro source or I.O. configuration, go to the right hand corner and select the option that you would like. If you would like more information about the specific setting, select the drop down menu for more details. The next page requests your important parameters. What is your motor's minimum and maximum speeds? What are the ramp up and ramp down times? And what is the max current that your motor should see? Here you select your technological application. Do you have a linear characteristic such as a simple conveyor belt or do you have a parabolic characteristic such as a simple fan or pump? The final request is for your motor's optimization. How should the drive measure the motor's internal information? Once you have made your decision, select Complete Quick Setup. Once complete, you have the option to go to the Jog page to manually test your motor and the parameters you just set, or you can just complete Quick Setup. Now that the drive has been commissioned successfully, we can go to Backup and Restore to save our settings. Here you can name the parameter setting whatever you would like. If you would like to access these settings and any others saved on the module, go to the second circle here and you'll see all the options saved where you can easily upload onto any G120 drive you would like. The last feature that I would like to share in this video is the diagnostics menu. Here you can see a list of all your active alarms or faults. If you need more information about a specific alarm or fault, go to the right hand corner and you'll see the cause and remedy in plain English. Should you need more help, select send email to send a request direct to Siemens support. This was just a quick review of the Smart Access module, and there are a lot of features that were not covered. If you're interested in learning more, please reach out. We would be happy to help.